Hey guys, it's Susie and welcome to Let's Make It. Today we're going to learn how to take this $3 thrift store find and turn it into some awesome handwritten artwork just like that. Let's make it! So I love thrift stores. It's a really great place for you to find some unique things for your home, but also find some stuff that'll work for your DIY projects. Today what you need is a picture to work with, and you can find them at the thrift store in the picture frame aisle or where they have all their artwork. And I got mine for $3. It's basically a mocha print with Mod Podge around it, and I got it because I like the wood grain. Pay attention to the shape of it if you want the wood grain or not. Everything's going to be painted over, so it doesn't really matter. You'll also need some paint to paint over whatever picture you got. I have this heirloom white spray paint and I like spray paint because it gives a nice even finish. I have a charcoal black craft paint for my lettering, masking tape to mask off my wood and two different paint brushes, a bigger one for the lettering and a smaller one to give me detail or to clean up mistakes. All right, I've cleaned and masked off my picture and now I'm gonna go paint. Now we're ready to start painting. I already painted mine, but here are a few tips to get you started. Play around with different designs and fonts and phrases ahead of time in a piece of paper. That way you can figure out the placement if it's going to work well for you or not. Once you're happy, draw your design very lightly on your board. And when you're painting, rest your hand on the board. That way your hand stays steady. I like to work on a flat surface, but it's completely up to you and what will work. You'll have to make corrections. It's not going to be a perfect science. And it's a handwritten sign, so don't expect perfection. Have fun while you're doing it. I hope you guys found a phrase to work with this piece in your life right now. If you like this video, make sure you like it and subscribe and check out my other DIY videos. See you later. Bye.